God forgive me for the things I cannot change. My name is Robert H. Moore Jr. I am of sound body, mind, soul, and spirit. All right, if you follow uh, the last video in the courtroom, you heard me say um, we're implementing the 1970 Controlled Substance Act Statute 885A1 exemptions. Yesterday, uh, we are implementing the 1970 Controlled Substance Act Statute 885A1. And I claim the benefit of the 1970 Controlled Substance Act Statute 885A1. They entered the Reading Institute as well. Yeah, I'm sorry? They entered the Reading Institute. Yeah, so I'm ready to go to trial today. And mind you, like I said, we implemented the 1970 Controlled Substance Act Statute 885A1 exemption. Like I said, the United States does not necessarily It's not a matter for arraignment. Do you wish to plead guilty or not guilty? Do you still want to go further? I'm going to read to you what that existing federal law says. Exemptions and exceptions, presumptions and simple possession offenses. A1. It shall not be necessary for the United States to negative any exemption or exception set forth in this subchapter in any complaint, information, indictment, or other pleadings, or in any trial, hearing, or other proceedings under this subchapter. And the burden of going forward with the evidence with respect to any such exemption or exception shall be upon the person claiming its benefit. Uh, December 9th, 2013, I claimed that benefit. It's an existing federal law. I claimed that benefit, uh, I believe it was March 1st, 2012. I claimed that benefit on record in another courtroom, Clifton. In my hands, I have two negatives. One from the city of Clifton, New Jersey, charging me with the possession of marijuana. One from the city of Nichols, charging me for unlawful possession of marijuana. I'm done. I've done everything that, that I could do to, uh, you know, try to set the stage to clear my name, clear my business and protect the members of the business from any criminal activity um, deemed criminal by the DEA, federal. This plant behind me, I don't know what else that I could do, know what else I could say other than uh, Eric Holder, you need to be here in Passaic County. Uh, President Obama, you came to Patterson. You came here. This is the first planned industrial city. This is an industrial hemp cannabis sativa plant, and we're ready to do business. I don't know what else um, I could do. I tried to talk to the governor to get through the red tape. He said he would do the right thing, and nothing's been done. Because he did not do the right thing, I was negative again. So forget about the bridge gate. Hemp gate was a lot bigger. Oh, President Obama. You can make twine, you can make rope, you can make nets, canvas, tarps, carpet, uh, geotextiles, agrofiber, uh, break and clutch linings, caulking materials, apparels, diapers, handbags, uh, biofuel, uh, God, what else, uh, medicine, uh, shampoo, soap, lotions, granola bars, bird seeds. My dog actually likes these leaves. You got some dogs at the White House. My dog actually likes the hemp leaves. This is, um, it's not a game. And I am serious. We're here to conduct business. The paperwork is here. I'm going to send this and some paperwork regarding the case. Regarding the cases, excuse me. And hopefully we'll get some justice this year. Gameface.com. G-A-M-P-H-A-C-E.com. If you go there, you can do a little bit of research of, of what's been started.
God forgive me for the things I cannot change. Hope they hear it from the rooftop.